Hi everyone. <clears throat> I'm just getting everything set up here. <sighs> well, uh, it is New Year's Eve, folks. I'm not a huge holiday guy, but I figured, you know, I've been doing a few weird games lately, and I might, I might want to do a special weird game to uh, mark the occasion of the decade ending, because that is something. Ten's a lot. That's a lot of years. I'm gonna point my lamp so it's not getting glare in my eyes. Uh, you know what? Turn that sucker off. Uh, let's get the Katamari music out of here. That is a brilliant song. That's a, one of the best... One of the best. That's just it. There's no end to that sentence. Just best. Anyway, this is going to be 30 Flights of Loving. Uh, this is a, I guess you could call it a walking simulator. It's a little more than that, in my opinion. Or if it is a walking simulator, it's one of the finest. And it's pretty short, so this is a short stream. Be ready for that. It's going to be like under an hour, baby. Uh, let me just see here. This is the menu. Uh, you can read this if you want. I don't really want to. I'm hoping this is going to be a good volume. I might have to adjust. Uh, that looks probably fine. Career. Okay, so this is a... This is a game about cube people. And there's, there's actually two games, and one of them, I think Gravity Bone is like a prequel, almost. But I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do them in order in order that they are given. This is a free game. This is on Steam. You can play this for free. And I don't know how old this game is, but I'm pretty sure it's kind of old. Uh, yeah, so where I am, it's 5.26 p.m. Not quite, uh... Not quite the new year yet. You know, I suspect that it'll probably be fine, but I have to say I've been racked with anxiety. About, uh, oh, here, here we go, this will help. <laughs> I've been racked with anxiety about the possibility that uh, the new COPA regulations will, like, fuck up my job. Oh, there you go. That's cool. I know they probably won't, but it doesn't stop me from feeling anxious about it. This guy's got a gun under the table. Oh, I can take that. I don't know if you can actually shoot in this game, though. I think you just take ammo and, and drink liquor. Maple Victory alcohol-free beverage. Okay, never mind. Never was much of a drinker. Uh, yeah, let me know if the audio is at a good level. It seems a little loud, maybe? So, you know, symbolically, maybe this stream can be indicative of a timeline where I do stop making content and have to, like, move on and get a real job. <laughs> where I don't make money pushing geese off of ledges. That is loud, isn't it? That's a little loud. Midnight Hobo. Oh, you know that shit's real. That's real alcohol. Eat the guns, drink the bullets. So this, I, this could be a, my tribute to my own darkest timeline, where I just get fucked and have to go be a courtesy clerk or whatever. Oh, right. Yeah. So this is this is a pretty wacky game. It's very stylized. What is, what is all this shit? Pasaporte. Servidia. Is that a real? Is that a real place? I've never heard of that particular place. But this is clearly a heist. There's a heist about to go down. Uh, so I guess it gives us, like, a brief introduction to these characters every time you click on them. So yeah, everybody is cubes. It's never... that's never elaborated on. That's just a thing. What is this? 3D glasses? Oh, can I switch out these little things? No. 
Uh, it's just a bunch of geese here. I can't push them any further. They're already in the water. All right, the mission is beginning. Lovingly rendered animations. Yoi! I'm glad I turned the volume down a little bit. I like the copyright at the bottom. Super Video Graphic Array. Yeah, this is a hella cheesy game. So something happened. The, the timeline's skipping around, but now she's out of bullets and trying to shoot me, and everybody's all fucked. And I have no idea what's going on. All right, I got my buddy though. We're gonna get out of here. We're gonna get. We're gonna get you safe. You're gonna get to see your family again. None of these people have collision. Look, buddy, it's gonna be all right. For some reason, we're in space, but I think we're gonna be okay. This is a space train station. Get, get, get these out of here. Give me that thing. All right, we're gonna get you out of here, buddy. Uh, I am no speedrunner. I don't know which way to go. Oh. Oh. He's got oranges. Naranja. This is some Enter the Void shit. Ah, I can peel the orange, too. See, there is gameplay. What are you talking about, walking simulator? That's the best kind of gameplay there is. Although they can't do my special technique where I get it all off in one peel. Alright. I think we're about to... Yeah, we're about to walk the aforementioned flights. Alright, start counting. One... There's a kitty. Two... Ah, oh, look at the cats! Three... I like how there's shadows of the items, but not the people. Four... Man, cats are great. This is a pretty low fidelity game, but it, it looks really good, like, just for what it is. Oh, those were our gifts. Fun Cutters, Panther Pilsners, and Midnight Hobo. Oh, what's that? Hammered and Heard em. That th I don't even get that one. Alright, where's our table? Um, where are we? Wait, what? Yeah, who's this chick? Here we are. Pissing the night away. Pissing the night away. He takes a whiskey drink. He takes a vodka drink. He drinks a lager drink. He drinks a cider drink. He sings the songs that remind him of the best times. He sings the songs that remind him. Oh. Hey, kitties. I think we're both drunk. Yeah, we're definitely both drunk. I, I remember the bloom when I get drunk. That does happen. All right, kids, close your eyes. Oh, shit. She's right around this corner, right? There she is. Oh, we're back here. Okay. Right, 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 right. I was getting my friend. This Half-Life 1? Oh shit, oh. Fuck. This is some Wally -E shit. Rogue robots, rogue robots. Oh shit. Slide under there. Fucking, fucking slide under there. There we go. That was a great animation. That was a good loading screen. 
flying with Kugat Air. Forget your past. By the way, can I just take take this moment to say I have no idea like what this game is getting at? But I, I love it. I connect with it. For sure. What's happening now? This is more Half-Life. This is Half-Life 2. Oh, my guy's got guns! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! It's like GTA! So it's been a, it's been a little while since I've played this game, so I, don't, I, I do not remember the, the airplane pros. Nor this entire section. Oh, my fucking... Okay. Okay. It's been a little while. Is this Victoria's Secret Pink? Oh. I don't think that was Victoria's Secret Pink. I think we're in the T-Mobile store. Oh, God. I saw the title. I saw the title. Oh, it's her. Nice. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Two car crashes at once? It's a bit excessive, I think. Hmm, yes, yeah, very nice. Lovely game. This is, these are all you guys. Every single one of you is actually controlling. Chat is controlling these people. The end. Or is it? It kind of is. Sort of. Hmm, yes. Intriguing. Did you hear about the part where they peeled an orange? Alright, yep, yep. Chris Remo. This is good music, so I like it. Good job, Chris Remo. I'm sure all those people who got special thanks were, uh, you know, very deserving of it. This is like the Zion Garden, all of a sudden. Hey, there's our getaway plane. You remember that? Bernoulli's principal. This is Daniel Bernoulli. Here is his principal. <coughs> Fast moving air creates low air pressure. The higher air pressure moves toward the low air pressure area. The moving air pressure pushes the paper strips up. I guess we're looking at it. Can you believe they made an air simulator just to show us this? Unbelievable the amount of work they go into. They, they put all those oxygen molecules in there. All birds need to fly are the right shaped wings, the right pressure, and the right angle. Daniel Bernoulli. This is an airplane wing. The wing's shaped forces the air above the wing to move fast. This is like, uh, look around you. You, you ever watch that show? That is a godlike show. The higher air pressure moves toward the low air pressure area. This creates lift. So this is now a game teaching us about <coughs> aerodynamics physics. Okay, oh, never mind. Oh, that was it. Look at those chonky birds. Well, that's it. We're in the music video for 192000 Forever. But is that really the end? No. No, the answer's no. We still have Gravity Bone. Easily superior game. I still don't know what the hell's happening, but I like it. Oh, I can only see part of this card. Here we go. Teletrans 7. I just saw the inside of an old man's face and forever am traumatized. Private contracting service, the Saturday Club. Business initiative, wet work, go to the furnace room. Alright, excuse me folks. I believe this is the way to go. Oh. That's the- this is the exit zone. I think actually this comes up later.
Whoa. What kind of fancy establishment is this? Staff only? Uh, I would need a disguise. This is a very well-made skybox. That is definitely not just somebody's awesome hiking pictures <laughs> stretched over some 3D models. It looks nice. No, that's what that's what perspective is. That guy's got red hair. Um Do you know anything? I don't see no furnace room. Let me explore a little more. Um, I'll, I'll follow a staff member. Here. That's the way. Press space bar to jump. This one has a tutorial as well. It's so strange, the format of these games. Deliver this drink to the man with red hair. Actually, all of a sudden, we're playing jazz punk. I'm pretty sure. I bet... I bet you Jazz Punk takes fucking massive influence from this game. Actually. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, just coming through here with some cyan, I, I mean, the finest mint green wine ever devised. That's... he looks like Donald Trump. Okay, ooh, I'm out of here. Excuse me, sir. I like how they like say words. It's adorable. Congratulations. The monitor the beast bug placed into the wine glass was oh. successfully delivered. There was a bug in that glass. With persistence and ingenuity we can be I feel like the cyanide was overkill at that point. <laughs> yodeling. I hear yodeling in the background. Very faint yodeling. It's the worst way to hear yodeling, because it fills you with that feeling of dread. Like I said, this is going to be a very short stream. It's been like 20 minutes and we're pretty close to the finish. Errol Hoffert Tower. 70 70th floor. That's a tall tower. Holy shit. We're damn high up. Research. Snatch. Deep raid. Go to the furnace room. The word snatch was so powerful that it, like, altered my accent forever. Oh, what? Excuse me? What? I'm confused. There were pressure things, but they were going up. They were going upward. Oh, it came down really fast. I see. I was like, what? It was on its way up. Um... Oh, is this... Oh, I see. What what function do these particular machines serve, I wonder? It's some Galaxy Quest shit. Come on. Oh, I need to freeze the lock. Ice, then hammer. Boom. Gameplay. Ice, hammer. Gameplay. Uh, can I paint, like, a naughty word with this? No, it goes away. It fades. It's always the furnace room. <laughs> Are furnace rooms ever actually used for, like, furnacing purposes? I feel like not. Hammer. Hammer. I had to- I had to ice twice and hammer thrice there. Oh, let me out. You get a camera eventually. And you gotta- t I remember you gotta take pictures of birds. That's like the final mission in the game, is take pictures of birds. I think I missed the camera room. They made a whole, like, UI and, like, inventory system just to, like, switch between two things. I 
think down here, the other way, was the camera. Right here. Yeah. Photograph the five birds. Alright. I'm on the job. I'm Peter Parker. I'm young and impressionable, and I have a camera. And a dark secret. Oh shit, it exploded. I forgot the birds explode when you take pictures of them. Not accurate to real life, I must say. The cash register sound, that's totally a thing though. So yeah, I mean, I guess if I... If I don't live to see tomorrow, in terms of my, like, YouTubing career, I might be able to get by streaming, but, uh, you know. Remember me! Love each other! Fuck! Oh, did I have to do all this over again? God damn it. I, I need to save more. This one last part is actually kind of difficult. But I, you know, I think I would want to be remembered as a guy who championed the weirder games. And sort of the, like, you know, the, the good shit. I'm not just saying I hope people think I have good taste, but like, I hope that by streaming these, like, sort of lesser known indie hits, I, I, I hope I can get more people into sort of like weirder, artsier shit. Because that's, that's where the interesting things are happening with video games. Um, we. It is a nasty storm outside. Yeet! Yeet! Cha ching No, I'm not gonna stop making videos unless, uh, YouTube just crumbles. The thing is, if all that, like, Kappa shit, or Copa, that, uh, that people are saying, or that some people have said is gonna go down, actually goes down, I feel like that's just YouTube, YouTube committing suicide. Like, the, the website would not survive something like that. So, hopefully it was merely fear-mongering. Which, uh, is, you know... Do I save? Wait, how the f... <laughs> Quick save F6. Okay. Six and nine. Can you guys remember those two numbers for me? Six and nine. Do you think you got that, chat? Hey! Alright, how do I reload? Just kidding. Is this really how I have to do this? I seem to remember there being some sort of ridiculous platforming at the end. There we go. Oh my fucking god. Yahoo! Oh my god. Very, like, precision platforming. Fuck! Saving again. Um, man, I, I'm gonna be pretty annoyed, honestly, regardless, because I don't like having my emotions exploited for clicks. And there were quite a few videos out there that were like, Copa, you should be scared. And uh, now it's looking more and more like I shouldn't be scared, and I'm kind of like, come on, guys, don't. We're really still at that point of, like, exploiting people's emotions. Although people could just, I mean, it could just be that people putting that video out were also scared. Uh, probably not so much for the, like, real lawyer tells you you should be afraid video. That one was pretty stupid. That one was going around, and people were just, like, posting it as though it was, like, hard proof. It's like, if you look at any of that guy's other videos, they're all, like, they got like, they're like covered in poop emojis and like, they're about just like, absurd topics. Of like, interpreting the law in ways to like, make people 
hysterical. It was just, uh, it, I was like, wow, this is really stupid. Also, where's the last bird? I could have sworn I, I did all the birds. Oh, is there one up there, maybe? Fuck. Did I get them all? Oh, I just need to find the exit. Right, okay. Well, I know where that is. Right, no. Uh, mm, uh, Here we go. Why didn't I? I have a glowing red tunnel. Glowing red tunnel, and I didn't see it. Any plans for the new year? Uh, well, I got a couple of big videos lined up. I've been saying I'm gonna do the I, How to Break Isaac guide, and I still am doing that, but I gotta say, I've been procrastinating that like none other. I even said on Twitter a while ago, I was like, okay, now I'm starting to, like, work on it in earnest. And then I, I really haven't done much work since then. Oh. But I've got some, like, more sort of, like, scripted videos that I've, I've been writing and working on. Those are my big plans. I'm not, like, going anywhere so long as I survive monetarily. Uh... Okay, well, I stand corrected. I don't know where the exit is. I think I took a wrong turn after this tunnel. Right, do I, I want to go out. I just want to get to the escalator that I came in on. Yeah, oh my god. Right here. Foolish. Oh. Excuse me. Oh, it's this bitch. She was outside the party. What's up with you? Dr. Jane Goodall, what are you doing? Oh my god, she she's taking the bird pictures! Not my- no! My aviology class homework. That is not what it's called. Oh fuck yeah, chase sequence. I'm not gonna let this bitch get away with my bird photos. Holy shit. Did she go down here? There's, a, there's gonna be a train. I'm gonna die. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. You- oh, 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 oh. Look at her. Look at her. Oh, she's so smug. She's taking a little puff in between jogs. Come on. Yo, he Oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, shit. No, sorry, guys. She's going this way. I'm so fucking sorry. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Actually, what the hell is this? Is this... What the fuck is happening? Am I even the same character from the first game? I don't know. I don't know, I just like it. That's it.